And now, it is time for the Royal Rumble match. Now in this match, the two superstars that drew number one and number two will start. Other superstars will join in the order that they drew. This will continue until all four superstars have entered the ring. Now the only way to be eliminated is to be thrown over the top rope with both feet landing on the floor. The last man in the ring will be declared the winner of the Royal Rumble and will advance to the main event of WrestleMania. Introducing first, from Pineville, West Virginia, weighing 232 pounds, E. Slater. two competitors in the Royal Rumble. It's no secret that I love the Royal Rumble. I can't wait to find out whose moment's gonna come tonight. <laughs> He's Slater, you talk about a cocky, confident athlete. You know, I guess he has reason to be, Michael. He's tough, he's strong, moves lightly on his feet, and for someone so young, he's very comfortable in the ring. He could be set for a ride. King, what's the strategy for a Royal Rumble? Oh, that was close. He's coming back through the ropes. We'll have our third competitor momentarily. Our truth! Tell us what's up! Set you free! One of the things you have to come to terms with in the Royal Rumble is you can work with a partner all you want, but in the end, it's every man for himself. Though his age may not... Is he, is he out? No, he made it back in! Watch it! The neck isn't supposed to bend like that. With his high-flying offense, Evan Bourne is one of the most exciting cruiserweights to debut in WWE in recent years. There's the counter by Evan. The Royal Rumble really is our all-star game, except our all-star game actually means something. A guaranteed opportunity in the main event at WrestleMania. Superstars have a hard time keeping up with the speed of Heath Slater. This young man is very fast. Slater can go, we know that. Boy, the time just flies, doesn't it? And here comes Cody. He's still in this one. Ah, look at this. You'll see superstars use strategies like hooking the rope, hooking the turnbuckle, anything to stay off the floor. Remember, it's over the top rope, both feet touching the floor. We all know what's at stake in the Royal Rumble. A chance to headline WrestleMania in a place in the history books. And did you hear that kick from Evan Bourne? Trying to thin the herd. Royal Rumble rule. And he's still in this. Incredible kick by the swashbuckling Evan Bourne. He might be done here. It's almost time for the next competitor. The Miz with conceit in his eyes. The Miz makes his way to the ring. 
tough for you to get down on your knees. Again, each one of these men fighting and clawing for their shot and headlining WrestleMania. Miz controlling the head. Again, this match is to determine the number one contender for the championship at WrestleMania. An awesome counter from the most must-see superstar in WWE history. Tell me the truth, Michael Cole. What is it that makes you so fond of The Miz? It's simple. He's awesome! Oh, please. Who's next? First then, he looked pretty good doing it. It's Captain Charisma. It's Christian. Going for the elimination. Trying to get one step closer to his dream. Ladies and gentlemen, the Miz is indeed the most must-see WWE superstar ever. Cody's history. And boxing. Great match here, but if you missed any of the matches from this week, go to WWE.com to catch up on all the action. I like to compare The Miz to a bit of Luthez, Harley Race, and even Shawn Michaels. I mean, all three of them combined into one super being. And I like to tell you that you have no idea what you're talking about. To have another one. He might be going. Santino, and I don't think he looks too eager to get into this one. And he's fighting to stay alive for the second time in this match. Again, the winner of this Royal Rumble match will go on to headline WrestleMania. Two months. Miz controlling the waist. Oh man, hurting the ribs of the lower back just takes all of the power out of it. King, I don't think there's ever been an athlete in the WWE I've been more enamored with than The Miz. Boy, I can tell that's a fact. It looks like they'll have to have your lips surgically removed from his backside. Heath Slater into the headlock. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Behind the back, and Slater sneaks it in. He drops the elbow. What a haymaker! A huge right hand! Christian's been eliminated! Who's gonna enter next? Here comes Demolition member Smash! Remember, no pinfalls, no submissions. You must throw your opponent over the top rope with both feet touching the floor. The damage has definitely been done. Now it may just be a matter of time. Hanging out again. You can see the wear and tear that this fight has taken out of these men. And for the second time in this match, he could be out of here. Santino started off in control. How long he can keep it is a different story. The WWE Universe loves it when Santino is dishing out a beating. Reversal by the Miz. Heath Slater squeezing down on the head. Get ready. Another superstar is about to head out. It's Jack Swagger, the All-American American with a genetic disposition to succeed in this contest. Yes, it's cover time! He might have dodged his last bullet. Oh, with Swagger's amateur background, it's so hard to outmaneuver that young man. Miz got rocked with an awesome fist. And they pushed him out. They got him out. Smash loves to work people over with his power and size. An elbow. Number 10 will be joining us momentarily. It's the end. 
Enforcer, it's Arn Anderson. Every move Miss makes is with purpose. He's not flashy in the ring, he's effective. And most importantly, he's a winner. All the damage to the torso, all the pain that's been dealt, appears to have finally taken its toll. Oh, he's going for the eyes. That's such an effective move. Yow! Vicious shot to the lower back. Arn Anderson's a master of the DDT, the Spinebuster, a phenomenal athlete, is the enforcer. Looking to get an elimination. Swagger's extremely arrogant, but there's no doubt that the All-American can back up everything he says. He set an NCAA record with 30 pins in one season. Who's coming out next? Hey, it's Daniel Bryan! What do you do? Uh-oh, he's in trouble! How can you not be impressed with what The Miz has accomplished over the past couple of years? Yeah, The Miz has accomplished a lot, but he never fails to let the world know about it. What a loudmouth blowhard. He's fought out of it. The upstart, Jack Swagger, has been eliminated. Why don't you tell me why you really don't like Daniel Bryan? What, did he steal a girlfriend of yours once? He's a nerd. I don't like nerds. He's in a precarious position. Great counter. Daniel Bryan is simply amazing. Oh, there's another hit. Could we be on the verge of an elimination? I don't think so. Anderson has the headlock. Arn Anderson can do so many things well. He's a brawler, a grappling specialist, well-versed in submissions. Well, he's the enforcer, Michael. Plain and simple. He's nearly out of this one. Nice veteran move by the Enforcer. Next entrance, getting ready to come out. He's hanging on again here. The Big Red Monster. And with his history, you know Kane will have a profound effect in this one. Right to the chin with the knee. And maybe this will be it. Pushed him out. They got him out. No, that didn't just happen. Oh, yes, it did. And it was awesome. Come on, King. The Miz wasn't ready. We need to restart this match right now. Yeah, well, that's not going to happen, Cole. Again, this is every man for himself. Which one will win this first leg on the road to WrestleMania? in the back of your head in a rumble. You never know who's going to sneak up from behind. Oh, he's coming back in. What great action we've had in this match. Big move coming. And a heads-up counter by Santino. Locked. Call your friends. Let them know what's going on right now in this awesome match. Ezekiel Jackson looks ready to go. It's when you go hard. Kane with all that strength. Look at hard. Vintage Anderson. This is game what you call domination. It's a combination of skill and concentration. Surround me and Kane. Do something amazing. Ezekiel Jackson. 
And he's fighting to stay alive for the second time in this match. These guys are giving it absolutely everything they've got. Moments away from the next entry. It's the world's largest athlete in the big show. He could be set for a ride. Oh, man. He got turned inside out. Now taking a moment to feel those ribs and King, it appears that there may be some internal damage. It looks like it. Those ribs have been targeted so many times over the course of this match, I wouldn't be shocked if one or two maybe cracked right now. Oh, no! You can see the pain shoot through this superstar's body off that slam. Now that's how you do it. Having to fight for his life again. We saw it all in this match, King, and those repeated blows to the skull have definitely taken their toll. Well, I don't know if the head was intensely focused on, but it definitely took a lot of damage. And the massive Ezekiel Jackson counters it. Boy, the time just flies, doesn't it? He might be done here. Here comes the Hall of Famer. It's Ricky, the Dragon Steamboat. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? Hanging out again. When Big Show is motivated to do something, there's not another man in the world that can stop him. He's very motivated tonight. That landed like a ton of bricks. I think I know who's going to be eliminated next. We know what this is. Oh, lights out. for the elimination, trying to get one step closer to his dreams. Well, that was close. He's coming back through the ropes. He might be going. Big Show's offense kind of looks like a bowling shoe. A size 40 bowling shoe. Look at the corner, Michael. This doesn't bode well. King, as soon as this match is over, we may need our medical personnel down here to check on the injured ribs and back. Yeah, if this keeps up much more, we may need them down here before that. Ow! Hard kick to the ribs. These matches are so dangerous. You never know when or where you're going to get attacked from. Here comes the new favorite, Mark Henry. What an incredible suplex. The longer this match goes, the more moves like that will add up. In a counter by the Hall of Famer. Hanging on for the second time in this match. Goes behind. The power of Ezekiel Jackson. Look at him clutch that rope with everything he's got. The dragon is eliminated. Trying to thin the herd. I'll tell you, when you face Big Show, you have to work on those legs. I don't know of any other way to beat this giant. We saw it all in this match, King, and those repeated blows to the skull have definitely taken their toll. Well, I don't know if the head was intensely focused on, but it definitely took a lot of damage. Mark Henry is one of those rare guys. Look at this! Santino's been eliminated! Henry from behind. What a move! What a smart move! He's on the ropes in the corner. He could be done here. Kane sees Evil King, and he likes it. I know. And the slower, the longer he can drag out the pain on his opponent, the more pleasure he gets out of it. Kane in 
enjoys punishing his opponents. He relishes every one of those sadistic moves. Is he, is he out? No, he made it back in. Trying to impose his will in the corner. It's almost time for the next competitor. Oh my gosh, it's Nash. It's Kevin Nash. Oh, whoa, whoa. to get an elimination. Big sexy, Diesel the outsider, no matter the persona. Kevin Nash has always been a major threat. Yeah, well, it doesn't hurt to be nearly seven feet tall and over 300 pounds either. Oh, come on, King. There's been plenty of big men. What's given Nash the advantage over them is his mind. Nash is always mentally two moves ahead. Who's next? It's Husky Harris. And that series ends in deadlock. Neither one of these superstars can afford to give their opponent the upper hand. Kevin Nash wants to hit his patented jackknife. That's a move that practically destroyed an entire generation of superstars. Oh, man, did you see that? Talk about hang time. And he's tripled up. There goes Ezekiel Jackson. Would you listen to this crowd show their appreciation for these amazing competitors? You are watching the global phenomenon known as the Royal Rumble. This event is being broadcast worldwide to the United Kingdom and Canada and elsewhere in locations like Australia and Mexico. And of course, to our fighting service men and women on the Armed Forces Network. Kevin Nash controlling the head. And now trying to shove and fight and hoist his opponent over the rope and out of the ring. Those X's on CM Punk's wrists are the universe's sign of the straight edge lifestyle that Punk embodies. Look out! A massive right. Big Show's plowing a path to destruction. We're two-thirds of the way through the Rumble. And now we'll see what Morrissey can do in this match. He's in a precarious position. Bye-bye, Big Sexy. CM Punk, the self-proclaimed Second City Saint, is looking extremely impressive. Could we be on the verge of an elimination? We're about to have another one. likes to claim that he is the world's role model. He says that he can lead you to the promised land, too. John Morrison's spending more time on his mat work because we know he's an honor student as far as high flying is concerned. Thanks to his unique training, Morrison's to find himself now as one of the great innovators in WWE history. Yeah, you never know what John's gonna do next. 
and now trying to figure out how to hoist this man over the top rope. John Morrison loves to win and loves to look good doing it. Matches are so dangerous. You never know when or where you're going to get attacked from. Who's going to enter next? We're talking. It's the five time. Zack Ryder's been eliminated. John Morrison is proficient in parkour. Parkour being the art of proving, allowing Morrison to do things unlike anybody else in the WWE. That arm is completely incapacitated. He's basically down to one arm now. Morrison's been taken out. He's nearly out of this one. CM Punk, the Elliot Ness of the WWE, would like nothing better than to enforce his own beliefs and lifestyle choices on the rest of the WWE Universe. It's Road Warrior Animal. Punk's out. CM Punk vows to win every match to set the example for the WWE Universe. Oh man, that's not where you want to be in this type of match. The Royal Rumble's always so exciting. You never know when your friend or foes are going to enter. Animal looks great. He hasn't lost a step. comes 24 and entering the match at this stage is such a huge advantage no works. <laughs> oh, he's coming back in. Back and forth this match goes. How do you beat this giant? Short answer, you don't. Oh, that was close. He's coming back through the ropes. And he does it one more time. Who's coming out next? This could be the end. It's Wade Barrett. Time to show us what you got, Wade. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Animal is so dangerous. When he can target and batter an opponent with his strength and power, you know the end isn't far away. Power slam by Animal. In the corner, fighting to stay in the ring, fighting for survival. Tyson Kidd bringing the pink and black attack. Hey! A 
Frank Steiner, that type of speed is so hard to contain. Uh-oh, he's getting worked over there in the corner. Next entrance, getting ready to come out. William Regal, the 2008 King of the Ring. Barrett had that well scouted. Might have dodged his last bullet. He's trying to get the blood flowing to his brain. He's taking control again. You watch this. I mean, Wade Barrett's not a guy you'd describe as remorseful in any way. This could get real bad. If you want to look for a motivation behind Barrett's aggression, it's the almighty dollar. The former bare-knuckle fighter is always looking for a way to pad his already sizable bank account. Here comes Mason Ryan! The kid likes to talk about how he hoped to one day be as good as the superstar he grew up watching. By now, Tyson believes he's better than all of those legs. A 441-pounder has been eliminated to fight for his life again. Tyson Kidd's been ejected. Oh, tremendous right hand to the temple. This, oh no, look at Barrett's eyes. Wasteland. Barrett pancaked him. He's set up in the corner. Can he find the right combination of moves to pick up the elimination? King, look at the way he's feeling that arm. Yeah, I think he's checking to see if it's still in one piece. King, he's out again. Is he, is he out? No, he made it back in. This young man, Wade Barrett, is so dangerous, both physically and mentally. Watch out here. Regal, vicious and physical. 29 is on the way, and what an advantage he'll have. Ryan comes up with a great counter. Cena, John Cena with fire in his eyes. Mason Ryan, unquestionably the powerhouse from Wales. Oh man, what a knee lift. He could be set for a ride. This arena is absolutely electric for John Cena. Looking to get an elimination. Look out! Animal counters. Moments away from the next entrant. He's still at not this. Yes, Eddie. It's Eddie Guerrero. And maybe the good brief. Could we be on the verge of an elimination? Mason Ryan is a beast. Oh, man! What impact from that suplex! We're gonna see a lot of effective moves like that in this match. Cena just one heartbeat quicker on that exchange. Oh, the punch connects. Back and forth! How do these superstars keep doing it? Oh, look at Cena go! Look at this. Look at the power of John Cena. Attitude adjustment. 
There goes Regal. John Cena's ground game is always to the point. Oh, my goodness. Eddie Guerrero is just so hard to stop. Hanging out again. Boy, the time just flies, doesn't it? And he's still in this. It's Justin Gabriel. Eddie Guerrero really is in phenomenal shape. Yeah, there's hardly an ounce of body fat on him. Counter by Mason Ryan. On the ropes, fighting for survival. The official's going to have his hands full with Guerrero. You know he's going to be looking for any opportunity to win this. He's fought out of it. Oh, if there was ever a man that could outsmart his opponent, it's Eddie Guerrero. He always seems to be three steps ahead. It's almost time for the next competitor. These matches are so dangerous. You never know when or where you're going to get attacked from. Here comes Sheamus. John Cena came here tonight to battle. John Cena came here looking for a fight. And that's exactly what he's going to get. Sheamus throwing more pain, more hurt. Looking for a way to get the elimination, but there's no instruction manual on this. That's not good. He's the most controversial. Not again! An animal delivers another power slam. <laughs> nice, well-placed kick to the ribs. Very Gabriel's out! Sheamus' strength. How about his smarts? Yeah, I'll be the first to admit, this guy's good. And the knuckles connect. And for the second time in this match, he could be out of here. There goes Mason Ryan. And Sheamus unloads. Countered by Eddie. Sheamus, the first ever Irish born WWE champion. Oh, watch it! He's in big trouble just trying to hang on. I can't believe it! Cena's been eliminated! Look at this! Look at this! connects and this seesaw battle has changed again Ooh, hard shot to the road warrior intercepted uh oh this is bad who's next a quick punch to the gut and here comes the pain and now trying to muscle him out over the top rope. Oh! King, unfortunately, you felt Sheamus' strength firsthand. Yeah, you're right about that. I don't know if there's anyone in the WWE that has as much power and strength as Sheamus. letting his fist do the talking. Trying to thin the herd. Oh, he's coming back in. Sheamus, collar and elbow tie-up. Very smart move there by the veteran road warrior. King, this Sheamus is just flat out mean. Yeah, I've never seen anyone who enjoys hurting people as much as Sheamus does. They're about to have another one. What happened? Demolition. 
Here comes X. This Brock Lesnar guy may physically be on a completely different level than anybody else I've ever met. He's on the ropes in the corner. He could be done here. Oh, that was close. He's coming back through the ropes. When I look at Sheamus, I just see that white body. It reminds me of a corpse. In fact, I might like him better if he were one. Is he, is he out? No, he made it back in. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Sheamus enjoys showing absolutely no remorse. Oh, man, he's all wrapped up there in the ropes. Trying to hold on. Who's going to enter next? It's The Undertaker. Look at the eyes. He's still in this one. Sheamus controlling the waist. Trying to impose his will in the corner. Oh, what a counter by Eddie. This guy's so good. Remember, it's over the top rope, both feet touching the floor. And there goes Eddie Guerrero. With The Undertaker, the legend grows and grows. Looking to get an elimination. Brock Lesnar goes behind. Axe looks like he's out to demolish and destroy him right now. Hanging on for the second time in this match. Lesnar stops that one. Lesnar at times can change. Hey, he's going for it again. He might be done here. And he's still in this. Get ready. Another superstar is about to head out. It's time for some controlled frenzy. High impact, no mistakes. That's Undertaker style. Sporting the face paint, which he uses to help intimidate his opponents. He's hanging on again here. Moving on pure instinct now. What will it take to finish this superstar? Oh, he's coming back in. Ah! Kofi's unorthodox offense has racked up quite a record here in the WWE since debuting in early 2008. And now trying to shove and fight and hoist his opponent over the rope and out of the ring. Right on the tailbone. Boy, he's really done his homework for this match. And maybe this will be it. Oh, that was close. He's coming back through the ropes. Animal from behind. Watch it. He's on the apron. Can he force him to get both feet to touch the floor? The dead man's gone. Oh, he's in trouble. Come on. Don't do this, Seamus. Going for the elimination. Trying to get one step closer to his dreams. Two 
slow, and momentum turns 180 degrees again. Kofi Kingston treating this place like his own private amusement park. Knee lift. He's almost out right here. Who's coming out next? There's a counter by X. Great reaction. Here comes Del Rio. He's in a bad spot again. We saw it all in this match, King. And those repeated blows to the skull have definitely taken their toll. Well, I don't know if the head was intentionally focused on, but it definitely took a lot of damage. Lesnar had that scouted. In a shot to the solar plexus. Not fast enough. Hanging out again. Brock Lesnar is an animal. An animal that is obsessed with being a world champion. He might have dodged his last bullet. Sheamus has been eliminated. Is he, is he out? No, he made it back in. Tremendous force behind that shot from Animal. Axe into the headlock. He might be going. Very likable young man is Kofi Kingston. He is. This young man always has a smile on his face. And a jaw-jacking punch. Oh, and he lands that one right to the head. In the corner, just a few feet from being out of this. Del Rio countered that nicely. And he's fighting to stay alive for the second time in this match. Next entrance, getting ready to come out. Del Rio's been eliminated. I don't believe it. And for the second time in this match, he could be out of here. by Kofi. Oh, that elbow's got to hurt. Could we be on the verge of an elimination? <laughs> and Axe is out. Moments away from the next entrance. <laughs> Randy Orton enters with malicious intent. These matches are so dangerous, you never know when or where you're going to get attacked from. He's hanging on again here. Oh, the longer Orton's in control of this match, the more dangerous it becomes. He's still in this one. Uh-oh, he's in trouble. Boy, the time just flies, doesn't it? Remember, it's over the top rope, both feet touching the floor. And he's fighting to stay alive for the second time in this match. 
Orton's going into that almost psychotic state that he can turn himself into. Oh, Michael, he's a third. What's he thinking here? Nice head scissors. Oh, wow. Sick flying out of the ring. Here we are, KO. The Viper strikes. He's in a precarious position. And now three competitors remain. Just, uh-oh, Kingston, Kobe, trouble in paradise. <laughs> Kofi's got him in big trouble. When you watch Orton in a match like this, it's like he goes into some sort of zone. He's in some sort of strange place in his head. You could almost describe his emotion at times as emotionless. Well, maybe his face is emotionless, but I think there's all sorts of evil things going on in that sadistic mind of his. Flex. Boy, how impressive does Hawk look? Look at the size of those arms. Right in the kisser. That hand had a lot of force behind it. He's got over the top rope. Now will he get both feet to hit the floor? He's fought out of it. And that one hurt his hand. Yow! The veteran road warrior gets a great counter. Ah, look at this! Orton. Controlling the waist. Big move coming. A quick knee lift. Oh, Hawk's one of the most volatile people to ever compete in WWE. You want to talk about loose cannons? He was the original. What impact. All the damage to the torso. All the pain that's been dealt appears to have finally... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. RKO! <laughs> Trying to thin the herd. We saw it all in this match, King, and those repeated blows to the skull have definitely taken their toll. Well, I don't know if the head was intentionally focused on, but it definitely took a lot of damage. And maybe this will be it. And that's it for Kofi. wins. Here is your winner, Warrior Hawk. He's headed to WrestleMania. This was a kind of match you tell your kids about. I can't tell you how proud I feel to have helped call this Royal Rumble.